club was formed in 1971. In 1979, we've got our clubhouse here, as you can see. Today, we had about 100 kids out playing. There's about 250 kids on the books. Our first 15 are doing very well in the, in the league. Uh, sitting second at the moment, which is uh, a lot higher than what a lot of people would have thought we would have got to at this stage. So we're just trying to build on that and uh, look good for the future. Uh, we all have a good laugh on the day, but when we get on the pitch, we're all, we're all there for each other. It's a good team spirit and it's a good laugh to be with these guys. It's my home club. I grew up here watching my dad play on these pitches. Um, it's home to me. Um, I, I love coming down and uh, hanging out with the guys and uh, showing them that at my age I can still cut it. We've got a really good set of backs and we're just really trying to run everything. A really young set of forwards as well, so really, really good fast game of rugby we're playing right now. Uh, we were actually promoted two leagues. Uh, there was four or five teams came down, so it's really been a, quite a step up for us this year. Uh, really pleased with the way the boys have you know, put the performances in this year. Uh, we're very ambitious, we're looking to win this league and, uh, and keep on climbing. We're, we're incredibly excited about the Bill McLaren Foundation accreditation. It's so in line with what we've been pursuing at Hillfoots for the last three years here. We've grown for, to 60, then to 150 kids, and this year we've had nearly another 100 new kids joining us this season. And it's all founded on the positive coaching ethos. The Bill McLaren Foundation is trying to spread this message that competitive rugby is great, but for ch children and juniors it's really all about making sure they have fun, they're engaged with the sport, and that way they keep playing it. Funding in the club is a, it's a very important part of the club. I have to thank all the sponsors that we have at the moment because if, if it wasn't for these guys uh, sponsoring us and giving us money and helping us along, the club wouldn't be here. It's always been a club where everybody has pulled together to make things happen. When I first joined the club, we didn't have a clubhouse. We changed at the school and walked down and played in the park. And the club has a history of when things need done, people pull together and get on with it. And we've always tried to involve the community. We're here!